anyways, super late to saying hello to you guys already because it's already actually 2.02. But uh, this morning, I went to Polina's house, got my makeup done for the most part. I did a little bit of it, but for the most part, Polina's did my makeup and she did my hair. So we got some nice uh, curl looking thingo bobbies. And I let the pretty fall because today we had a baptism or christening to go to for Andre's cousin's baby. So here we went there but we missed that whole entire thing at the church anyway. <laughs> we just went there and took photos, but it's okay. Um, at least we were still in the photos, so there's still proof of us being there, right babe? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's important, right? Mm -hmm. Wait, what's wrong with you? Nothing, just send it. Just send it. Here we go again with the just send it thing, guys. <laughs> Andre's wearing, is this called the suit? Yeah, it's called the suit. Okay, yeah, fuzzy. Thank you. Um, Andre's wearing a suit. I'm wearing this shirt. It has like some ruffles right here and this like dress, but there's like a slit right here, which is why it looks like that, but not, not a dress. What am I saying? A skirt, but it's actually like a longer, longer skirt. And I feel like I should wear this on Tuesday to school because it's a perfect teacher outfit as well. And then I have a blazer hanging the back there. Mm -hmm. my, mom, my mom's going to sew it by like five inches. Sew it together so it's not as big of a slit. So yeah, I, my, my mom already knows she got she got to sew it so I can wear it to school. But otherwise, it's like a good teacher outfit, and it's easily sewable, you know. Bad teacher outfit. It's a bad teacher outfit. Why? You know. No, I don't know. Bad teacher. I'm a bad teacher. Where? Okay, you're getting all uh, sexy, licious over there. <laughs> Anyway, so we are going to Andre's house now. He has to do a couple of shop errands at the celebration party thingy, dinner, lunch, whatever thing is at 2.30. It's 2 or 4. So we have some time before we have to be over there. So we're going to go run some errands and then we're going to be at that party event thingy afterwards. Okay, so I'm waiting for Andre's currently in storage. I decided to just uh, wait and chill in the car. And I am waiting for Andre. And it is already 2.38. So now we are late for this event thing too. But he had to get some stuff done. So it's, you know, it's, the li it's life as a business owner. That's exactly what it is. Because I know the feeling just from Etsy and everything. Like I'm always running to the post office trying to get cupcake toppers out and mailed. So people could get them on time. Um, there's a couple of people that ordered this weekend already, but it's like I can't even ship it tomorrow because tomorrow I think is what is it Columbus Day? I think it is so tomorrow the post office is closed and I don't have um, Work as a teacher because we get that day off as well um, Yeah, it's Columbus Day. So we got that day off as well and the po post office is closed because they're closed on all these kinds of holidays also so it's like, uh, if you need it by Friday, you've really got to purchase priority shipping, especially if it's like cupcake toppers, which, you know, a lot of people needed to purchase priority because it's like, I can't ship it on Monday as much as I would have wanted to, I can't do it. But I would have liked to because I actually have off on Monday, but that doesn't help me because it's closed. <laughs> It just sucks like I have all the holidays off as well as the post office does so it's like I could get orders done and everything but I still can't ship it no matter what so that part just sucks but it is what it is I don't know why this is going like in and out with the blurriness like why are you like not focusing on me what is happening right now it says autofocus Okay, now it's focused, I think. Um, I was trying to take some photos on you guys with this camera right now, I'm trying to post it for my Insta story, and it would not like get a good photo of my eyes. Like I was trying to get like all up close and personal with my eyes, like I'm trying to do right now, but hold on, let me change it to manual focus, I think, where I could select the spot, I think. I don't know, it's not working. What am I doing? Manual focus, you're supposed to be working for me. Maybe, maybe it is autofocus. I don't even know. Hold on. Let's try and there we go. So like I was trying to get a photo like this, but every time I take a photo, it comes out like blurry for some, re some reason. Like my eyeball just doesn't come out like crispy clean, if you guys know what I mean. I'm going to show you because I don't know what's wrong with the photo. And this one's like already edited a little bit. 
but there's my beautiful eye and it just doesn't look crispy clean as I would have liked it to and it looks darker as I'm showing you guys right now it looks more hazily brown um, in the photo but I took like a whole bunch of a uh, eye photos already <laughs> trying to get like the perfect one in a while i've been waiting for andre so but whatever it is what it is i just can't wait to go to this christening because i am hungry i need some food guys i need some foodies in my belly <laughs> Also guys, I haven't talked about this in a while, but I mentioned to you guys how I wanted to get this little hole on my face fixed and how I was going to do that, but um, I needed to do that in September. It was like middle September, the appointment, or like I think beginning of October or something, but then I happened to get a job, so I can't exactly get that done now um because it's gonna require like a week to two weeks of downtime where my face is gonna like scar up and like scab and everything so i can't get that done until maybe the summer but the summer they recommend not doing it because you know you're getting tanned and stuff and look who's coming dre dog dre dizzle dre dizzle he's looking a little serious why do you look so serious because why why I look so serious? Because she could have told me about this shit yesterday and I would have woken up earlier. I see. I'm sorry, Dre Dizzle. You like your new nickname though? What? Dre Dizzle? Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's so good. So, as I was telling you guys, I can't exactly get that taken care of now. Um, like everything just happened like with teaching so fast so I can't do that but maybe I could even do it during one of the breaks when we have off or something when we have off for I don't know Christmas but do I really want to be scabbed up on Christmas probably not so if anything maybe February break maybe I could get it done then um, because it's really bothering me and it's even so much more visible I feel like in makeup and I just I really don't like it I want to finally get rid of it once and for all and then I'll be like a happy camper so maybe February break but I will have to see I don't remember like when my break is or anything okay Dre Dizzle are we going to the party now I oh, know we're gonna drop this off we're gonna, we're gonna drop it at the house Monica will do the rest so she's gonna be late yeah she knows like who gives a <laughs> Okay, let's calm down, Levy. And please put your seatbelts on. No. <laughs> okay. We were just talking about because Andre was like, do I look sweaty? And I'm like, no, you don't look sweaty. And he's like, do I smell? And I'm like, you don't smell from here. And I was like, oh shoot, I forgot to put deodorant on today. And he was like, oh, you stinky pee. <laughs> and I just smelled myself and I'm a stinky pee. <laughs> so I have to go wash. I'll wash real quick and put some deodorant on because I don't know what happened to me at my deodorant today I totally like, forgot about it you know it's like it's harder when you don't have everything you have like a system when you're at home you know what to do and Shall like we? the following order and it's like when you're not home everything like it just gets messed up and I forgot deodorant so that's my story 8.01 p.m. all right guys we just got back home are you grabbing my booty you're eating my booty baby you're making me fall. That's not okay. I was just eating the booty like bros. I know, you were biting my booty, I saw. I felt it, you know, home skillet. But I don't want to fall either. Here's your towel that's home on your bed for fill it. You caught that? Home skillet trying to fill it like I mispronounced for lay all again. day. Let me have it again. Just gonna put it back on the bed. No, I'm not. <laughs> Slick with it. Get at me, girl. <laughs> Baby, actually, can I can I have that for a second? Time out. On delay, all right. <laughs> you don't know how to do that shit, girl. Yes, I do. You gotta end up fucking me up. Did it hurt? No. Damn it. <laughs> all right, all right. Wait, wait. You're gonna you're gonna whip around and hit me in the dick. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Did it hurt? No. Okay, I thought, that's My turn. My turn? No, it's never your turn. I have this giant bruise already. No, baby. Okay, I don't know. Like, don't don't hit me, I have a big bruise. Don't worry, I won't get the Babe, bruise. What no. side is the bruise on? Oh, both sides. Stop, yeah, stop, stop, don't hit me, don't hit me. I have a giant bruise. Oh, oh your bracelet fell. Ooh. Send it, babe. Send it. <laughs> baby, that was my hand. 
Don't worry, your hand is fine. No, I hurt. That didn't hurt. I want to show you guys my bruise. It's like on my leg. And it's just so Don't show them the bruises. A gigantic. Baby, it's on my leg. It's right yeah, here. Yeah, baby, but it's up there. Baby, it's no different baby, than it's wearing. Up there. Baby, it's no different than wearing a bathing suit. Baby, you don't need Baby, it. Baby, look. Okay, guys, it's on my leg. I promise. If I'm wearing underwear, for example, the underwear doesn't even reach there. Like, it's on my leg, not even on my butt. Okay? Here, babe, can you show them? Mm. I can't even show them. Look, I'm covering up everything. Mm. Mm. Do you see it? Mm. Yeah, so gross, guys. Mm. So gross. Sent Andre to go get my bag from the car. It's my gold bag that I have like um, makeup remover and stuff in it, and I definitely need some makeup remover because I'm wearing, you know, full on makeup. Oh, this is coming off. It's a Morphe kind of lip, but I like to eat, eat my um, lipsticks off for some reason it just always happens like I eat it off like I start it starts feeling wet on the insides and then I rub my teeth over it and then I end up eating it off my lipstick so that's why it looks like that I'm sure if I leave it alone it'll be fine because my sister's always stays and she leaves it alone and she could be wearing the same brand it's just it's me I like to just eat it off for some reason so I know there's a different background and everything but I'm cutting into the vlog from the future just so I could say goodbye to you guys and tell you what we did after um, I ended up taking my makeup off after the party and stuff so afterwards me and Andre ended up watching a movie because Polina and John saw a movie the other day and they recommended it and it's called Dirt Dirty Grandpa. So funny guys. If you guys are of age, watch that movie. There's a rated R version and an unrated version. But me and Andre ended up watching the rated R version only because that one was the free one on Amazon Prime with Amazon Video. So if you have Amazon Prime, it was free on Amazon Video, the rated R version. And then the unrated version was like $13 and you had to buy the movie. So we were just like, whatever, we're just going to watch the rated R version. I do want to see the other one one day, but I just didn't want to pay $13 to watch this movie. So... I definitely recommend the movie though if you're of age. It was hilarious guys. It was so funny. Oh my gosh. It was such a great movie and Andre loved it too. We both loved it. It was just really funny. So we ended up watching that and then we just went to bed and now I'm home and then I'm just going to start a new vlog. So I just want to say goodbye and thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed these this weekend of vlogs since it was actually fun and I was actually doing stuff instead of just teaching by day and then going to bed by night. So I was actually doing some fun stuff and I hope you guys enjoyed it. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please click that red subscribe button down below if you haven't done so already. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next vlog that I'm about to start right now. So I'll see you then. Bye!